Welcome with this tutorial for Dynamo. In this case, we will be creating grids using the Dynamo player. If you open the Dynamo player and search for the grid script, press on the input button to see all the settings you can do. This script allows you to specify the starting point for the X and Y direction. Determine the number of grids and the distance between them. This script also takes care of the naming, so you can also specify the starting character and number. Let's run the script to see the result. And there they are. Next, let's take a look at the way the script is built. So opening Dynamo. And let me first organize the nodes and clean up for the readability. So starting on the left. The inputs are set so you can determine the start X, start Y value. The endpoint for X and Y is calculated based on the number of grids and spacing between them. This data then goes into the code block that will create points by X, Y, and Z values. In the first block, a range is specified for the X values, for the Y value the start value for the Y direction is used. So that the grids are always the same length, the Z value is left to zero. The result of this grid node are two lists of points that are fed to the grid node. This is also done for the Y direction. After the grids are created you can renumber them, in this case. I feed the newly create grids into a code block that contains a range that is filled with a start character or number. And then based on the number of grids produces a list of characters or numbers. That will be written back to the grid name parameter value, using the set parameter by name node. So that's it, thank you for watching. You can download the script using the link in the YouTube description. Enjoy.